From the moment I opened my eyes as an infant, I have seen the angels. I didn't know that they were angels because I was only an infant, a very young child. Um, I see them physically as I would see you or anybody else walking down the street. I would see the guardian angel with every single person, regardless of their religion. When I became a parent myself, the angels um, told me that it was the most important job in the world. And even today I'm always shocked when a mother or, or a father comes up to me and says, what's my destiny? You know, that there has to be something more important and there they are, you know, with a child on their lap or, or a young teenage son standing beside them. And I'm shocked because they don't realise, you know, that is the most important destiny in a parent's life is your children because you're holding the future, shaping them. You're teaching them about love and how to care. You're teaching them right and wrong. You know, you can be the president of a country, you can be a big, well-known banker, you can be someone very famous, um, but the most important job you have is actually being a parent. You have to remember God has entrusted your children, he's given them to you as a gift. Your child shows you to be its parent, even with all, you know, what you might think is imperfect about yourself. They chose you and they loved you unconditionally before they came from heaven. I always remember one woman, she was telling me about her little girl that, you know, she had adopted. And, you know, she said, we were so focused on getting, you know, an infant. And it was in one of those Romanian countries. And she said, when we got there, all this that was lined up in front of us was, you know, three to five year olds. And herself and her husband kept saying, no, where's the baby? We want the baby, you know, because that's what she believed, you know, she would adopt was the baby. And she noticed a young child over by swings, you know, crying and looking tattered looking. And she just found her heart melted. And even the same thing happened to the husband. And I'm so glad that they listened to that call to adopt and that they even listened when they were at the orphanage and said yes to this little girl.